Hey, what's up? Welcome back to 918 Disc Golf. Today, we're back out here at Chandler Bear for another round of leveling up. Let's get into it. All right, like I mentioned, we're back out here at Chandler Bear. Of course, if you're new to the channel, this is actually the second episode of leveling up. If you haven't seen the first, I'd be sure to check it out. The link will be down in the description to find out why I'm still out here. But find out why I'm still out here. Yeah, <laughs> no one's out here too, unfortunately for him. But getting into it, the goal is still to shoot 10 down. Conditions are about the same as they were the last time, a little warmer. And when I say a little, I mean like this much warmer. So 10 down, we're not gonna take any holes for granted. We're not gonna do any ace runs. We're not gonna do anything stupid. So let's Smart get Smart disc golf, you heard it here first. 213 foot par three. I don't know why I said that. They're all par threes, so enough of that. Get into it. Oh, we're started off like we did the last time, except for more forward progress. It's a putt. It's actually a putt. No more no mini gang. No one likes when I use those. <laughs> the percentage has always increased, let's you just say that. Putt. It is not it. That's fine though. Tap in par, we move on. We don't need all of them, we just need 10 of them. Go ahead, Jacob. Nice. Pull two right up there, 206 feet. We don't want to be the imposter this time, so. Let's put it underneath the basket so we don't even have to putt. Yeah. A little short, short right? Putt, but I think being outside of the comfortable range that I was in the last time, maybe that'll help. Nice. And we got it. Pretty on the board. No imposter today. I didn't mention it in the intro, but we're not doing a punishment this time because honestly, no one said he wouldn't come back out with me again if I lost. I feel like that's punishment enough on top of having to come back out the bear. So here we are. All right, hold three. You know, last time this was a bonus birdie and I got it. Still think it's a bonus birdie, but I still want to get it. We're gonna go pyro this time, have it actually fight out a little more than the zone did. I think that's the play. Oh, that's money. Sit. That's still fun. Oh, that's, that's so fun. good. That's such a good shot. Jacob's feeling himself today. Right, but they're in, so. I even tried to sabotage you and you still made it. All right, guys, I think I missed it on the last hole. The last hole's 217 feet. This one, 177 feet. Kind of the same shot, but I'm gonna go zone this time. And the goal is to not put it back in the bush that I put it in the last time. If we can get tap in, that'd be great. Oh, you settle. Oh, that's perfect. We're in good, we're in business. I don't think you can ask for a closer tap in. That. Got a little turkey. Three in a row. I got myself a little turkey, but before we move into hole five, I do want to ask uh, if you're new to the channel and you're enjoying the content so far, if you consider subscribing, we're still on the hunt for 500 subscribers and any and everybody that subscribes to the channel helps us out tremendously and we greatly appreciate it. I believe right now we're sitting at around 478. So again, if you're enjoying it, buttons down below. Let's get back into hole five. All right, things are heating up. Hole five. T sign on U-Disc says 306 feet. We've established that that is a crackhead estimation. It's actually gonna be like 240. Um, and I threw the mutant the last time and I didn't push far enough to the basket. So we're gonna go pyro and see if we can get a little bit more forward carry, but still try to hit that line. All right, here we go. Yeah, mm -hmm. I think that's, it might be in the same spot as the last one. This is a very hard hole to get to. You gotta have a putt. We go four for four. Four for five. <laughs> this man's trying to lie to y'all. Four for four in a row, dingus. Yeah, but we've played five holes and we don't want to forget the fact that you missed hole one. Guys, it might seem like I'm trying to dig at Jacob but I'm really just trying to light a fire under his butt because I really don't want to come out here again. All right, hole six, 262 feet. Right out there, a bit of a tunnel. There's a little more room in the on the right-hand side of the fairway that you want to get to down there. That's where I found the last time and then almost three putt, but <laughs> snuck one in. Pulled it a little, that's gonna get through. Eight. Oh! Inches, guys. Inches. That was it's a game good. of inches. Usually the best rounds start with a bogey. 
Chandler Bear, the best round still with a par. Because pars play like bogeys. Very true. All right, we discovered the last time that there's two lines. I usually take the Anheuser line, but Nolan had me go up the middle. And we were successful, so we're going to do that again today. Uh oh. 120 feet, little ace run. I didn't say I was ace running, I said it is an ace run. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, that works. My P2 is ruined, but we're up there for a putt. All right, first awkward straddle of the day. Let's see if we can keep the birdie streak alive, though. I don't know, dude. I have no doubt today. We're beating 10. We're beating 10. All right, not going to get ahead of myself, but feeling pretty good. Six down through seven. Hole eight. 172 feet. If you watched the last video, something very detrimental happened to me. I'm not going to talk about it because it's not going to happen again. Literally, worse shot, better result. It'd be like that up there. All right, hole nine, 176 feet. Really just a little flick with his own. Put us down there to get us eight under. Yeah. Alright, before we get into the back nine of the course, do you want to give a quick shout out to all the locals lately that have been showering us with love on the course. It really means a lot to Nolan and I when you guys come up to us and let us know that you like the videos because seriously that's why we're out here man. We want to push the content for the local Tulsa area and show off what we've got because we are blessed. So absolutely keep coming out to us and we really appreciate it. Let's get into hole 10. All right, hole 10 is gonna be 250 feet. Shout out to the local that just smashed like a billion chains and didn't ace. I learned that there's no OB out here. Didn't clarify that in the beginning of the video, clarifying it now, which is why the ratings play so probably hard. So the road that's back there, not OB. Not worry about it this time. I'm gonna go pyro. Jacob's been loving this this today and it's worked. Let's keep it up. I think that's just fine still. Like, it's a little left. A little left, but like it's still in putting range, so I'm okay with it. The man just can't miss today. We went eight for nine on the front nine. We're already one for nine on the front on the back nine. If we could go nine for nine, that'd be sick. 198 feet. No OB again. No OB to worry about again. Zone Heiser shot. Hey, uh, Jacob, quick comment. You see that trash can to your right? That was your game last time we were out here. And I want you to know, you're a ray of sunshine today. No. Fade in. I think we've done it, boys. That looks like 10. Now we just gotta keep it. But we're not gonna just keep it. We're gonna go further beyond. Even further beyond! Ah! Hole 12, 265 feet. No longer elevated. Big change. I love it. It's, it's the same as last time. Minus a little fade, but that's okay. This spelled trouble the last time, but we're under the marker right now, so I'm chilling. We're gonna do the same thing and actually throw it with intention. PD, forehand, left side. I didn't roll the wrist. What do you know? It's a good shot. He just can't miss today. All right, hole 14. If you watched the last video, you know. The zone was somewhere around here, so I hope it's found a good home. Luckily, we still got this baby, and it's doing work today. 161 feet. Eyes are shot. That should be parked. Should have just done that the last time. What about oh, the zone? Tell me about it. For 13. 13 down. Haters will say it's fake. 
but it's 5.03 p.m. We don't have the daylight to fake this, baby. 236 feet that way. We go with the flick with the fireball. Close, uh, close enough maybe? Hopefully. Oh, I'm human. What if I just, oh. All right, hole 16, 210 feet. He's right out there, there's a little path that goes along the right side of it, but again, not OB, so we need to play close. Skip in. That's just fine. Hole 17, sitting 14 down, 191 feet. Back to the classic, got the pyro in hand. Uh, that's pretty dang good. Hole 18, final hole of the day. Final thoughts of the day. If you've stuck around this much, I really appreciate you. Again, if you're here still, I don't know why you haven't hit that subscribe button down below. See if we can finish off with a 16 down fireball on the outside, but 140 feet. Just ace it. Oh. That was... I really wanted the 17. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie, I was greedy. But I still think I can make that putt for 16. No! It's poetic, isn't it? Hey, 15 is still 15. And that's much better than 10. I don't know what that would actually rate. Um, kind of depends on who's playing out here, but what matters is I beat the course. And that means we get to move on to the next one. So, if you're ready for that, we'll see you back here in March at O'Brien. Peace. Mm -hmm.